This it says in 1 John 1. It says, this is my commandment in, in John, John 15. This is my commandment that you love one another just as I have loved you. You said all the world will know you, my disciples, if you love one another. John said, let's recognize who the children of God are and the children of the devil are. The world loves the children of the devil because the children of the devil give the world what they want. It's like partners in crime. They split the, um, they split the proceeds. Or like a mob or a gang. They're together. And they're buddies. And very tightly together. Greater love has no one than this, that, that one lay down his life for his friends. If the world hates you, you know that it hated me before it hated you. Now, if the world hates you, you know that it hated me before it hated you. If you were of the world, the world would love its own. But because you are not of the world, but I chose you out of the world, because of this, the world hates you. Just as testimony was made about me from someone, not one of your own, but another, those of you who are, who are considered to be Christians, but another, one who is not your own, And it's too late. His, his, vid, his video is buried. So you may find it, but it won't be obvious. He's given a testimony about me. Both publicly and privately. And yet you do not accept his testimony. Jesus gave the example of himself and of John. And the world has hated the Son of God. Just as Israel hated the Son of God, they were religious too. They were doing all they were doing too. They were Christians in effect. You say, well, they weren't Christians. Well, neither are those today. Neither are they Christians today. Neither are they, were they Christians then. They were not Christians then. They are not Christians today. They were not Jews then, they are not Jews today. Jesus said, I know those who claim they are Jews, but are not. If you were of the world, implication, you're not of the world. The word world would love you, would love its own. He's easing into it. He's saying if, make it, be, it can be either, either way. But because you are not of the world, he makes it clear. But I chose you out of the world because of this, the world hates you. When we see the multiplicity of Christian sites out there. People don't know what hatred is. Uh, hatred can be connected to malice. Hatred leads to malice. To where not only are you doing, you not only do you have ill wish toward that person, but that you also express that. That is malice. Ha wish, wish to harm another person. When you see a certain YouTuber that espouses violence, you Christians and you fools may um, virtually, as they like to say, although it's um, electronically imbibe with a violent man, 
but um, he had he he would not, and he had better not be your friend. That's a dangerous thing. You understand that? Friendship with the world is enmity with God. <clears throat> A slave is not greater than his master. 15 of John 20, verse. If they persecuted me, they will persecute you, will also persecute you. Who is they? Some small-minded group over here, the Muslims in this country? No, it's the world. When you see the hatred... and the unconcern for people. That, those are the world. Jesus loved the world. If they persecute, who, who are they persecuting? Who is being persecuted? They will persecute you. And if they don't, then there's something wrong. And a lot of you are, are, are blaring out how wonderful Christians you are. Because I chose you out of the, because I chose you, but because I chose you out of the world, the, because of this, the world hates you. <clears throat> if they kept my word, they will keep yours also. But these things they will do to you for my name's sake. So it's because of Jesus. There must be a difference between Christians and atheists. Hollowhead. And no, I'm not <laughs> I'm not seeking out someone to just to say that. I'm just saying generally. You you got to you know. You've got to use your head. Because without using it, it may as well not have anything in it. But these things they will do to you for my name's sake, because they do not, do not know the one who sent me. Persecution. Ex expected. If it's not occurring, don't say to me, oh, I hate people and they hate me back. Or, you know, I'm going to get them and then they got to get me. Oh, and the world hates me because of Jesus. They don't hate you because of your testimony. They hate you because you're wicked. Jesus said, a servant is not above his master. If they hated, if they hate me, they if they hated me, if they hate me, they will hate you also. Or if they hated me, they will hate you also. So my testimony is that someone whom you have little respect for and um. whom you will look at aesthetically and say, well, his videos aren't that great. And no, you don't necessarily know who I'm talking about. For example, when we think of um, Mr. Hippie Hair, Nathan, Waiting for Christ. I wanted to see promise in him. But that you know, that is not the way a Christian a Christian male Christian's haircut is done. I thought, well,
but the world, if the world hates Nathan, waiting for Christ, it is not because he has loved the world or done what's right, but he knows, and you know, perhaps he's done what he's done in ignorance. I'd like to believe so. You know he is hated, which is not right. Hated in a sense of intensely disliked. It's fine. But he is hated because he is cruel to people. He believes, as, as Paul did, or as Saul did, Paul, Saul. He was named Saul, my Saul, and he took up the name Paul. He was hated 